I need to pray. Hold on. Wait a minute. I'm getting a message from God. It's a transmission into my cerebral cortex. Hold on a minute. And then he's like, oh, Lord, I pray. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on a second. Inside edition. He's... Shit, I'm getting overcome with the faith again. He said I need another private jet. Oh, yeah. And this was during the time where the jerk was popular. Well, not really. It was kind of on its way out anyway. But I was still trying to hold on to that glory of the jerk. So I had this little routine that I would do at every dance function, every single fucking one of them. And unfortunately, I still remember kind of the beginning of it, so I'm going to give you a little sneak preview of what it looked like. This is like if the feds came up to me and like, Hey, Charlie, we caught you on camera burning down this Toys R Us. We, we know you're an arsonist. We have it right here. And my response is, I just love to create. I love to inspire and show unedited photos of myself. And if I can just inspire one person, then I'll have done what I set out on this earth to do. Hit him with the Mickey Mouse Clubhouse dance. Like, oh God, guess we got the wrong guy. He's not guilty, he just popped and locked on us. But it, oftentimes it's not fatal, it's something that does occur pretty frequently from what I remember. Now that's not to say that it's trivial because it can be fatal, so it's not exactly a diagnosis that you'd hear and start wiggling your finger and celebrating. Oh, my kid's got a respiratory virus? Oh, hot dog! So, let's go over the situation here today. James Corden's just one of those people where whenever I read something uh, like revealing more about him being an asshole, I can't help but like almost celebrate a little bit, like wiggle my finger. You know, maybe I even stand up and hit a little boogie with it. Oh, what's that? The SpongeBob? Huh? Oh, James Corden's being an asshole? Oh, you don't say. Weird. It's almost like I knew it from the get go. Whoop. Now hit him with the jerk? <sighs> well, I never thought this day would come. A YouTuber just made an apology video worse than Sienna May's iconic interpretive dance. For those that don't remember, Sienna May was a TikToker accused of sexual assault, and for some reason she marched into the mines of Mordor and hatched the most diabolical plan of all time, forged the worst video apology ever, where it was an interpretive dance apology. So she starts fucking boogieing out there doing some of this <clears throat> a little bit of a little bit of these and by god i'm ashamed to say it but she even did some of this now keep in mind this man is in his 40s now i'm sure you didn't need me to tell you that you can look at him and immediately deduce this isn't exactly a teenage boy here doing this cringe ass lip sync shit terrorists have infiltrated a local burger king oh jeez. And they're slitting the throat of the hostages. Jinkies. Hey, prayers to the families. <laughs> did I jump scare you? Yeah, I bet I did. You coward.